Hi, today I'm going to be doing a quick review on the Gold's Gym Switch Plate 100. They're an adjustable dumbbell that weigh 50 pounds each, so 100 pounds total. They are selectable from 10 pounds all the way up to 50 pounds in 5 pound increments. Uh, they come with a stand. The stand is mostly steel except for the plastic little saddles that the dumbbell set in. Okay, to adjust them, you can just grab these little plastic tabs, you lift up, and you move them wherever you want. So you can go to 50, 45, 40. Once you've done that, now there is a, way, a proper way to lift these. You have to lift them straight out, just like that. If you, if you lift them at an angle, you're probably going to, one of the plates is going to hang up. Now, I bought these used on Craigslist. Uh, I got a really good deal on them. They weren't hardly ever used at all, but they were a little sticky. So what I did is I took some spray lube and I lubed up every one of these plates. And ever since then, I've had no issues with it at all. Here's a side shot of the dumbbells. One issue I do have with these dumbbells is they're really long, which is a problem with most adjustable dumbbells. But if you compare uh, this length to this would basically be the length of an equivalent Pro Gym weight. So you can see it's quite a bit longer. But once you get used to them, it's really not that bad. I've seen some of the, um, I forget the name of them, but the plastic coated ones, and they're a good couple inches longer than these. So out of all of them, these are fairly compact. And they're built fairly, fairly rugged. They have a nice handle with a rubber insert here. They're the, actually the bigger handle, so it helps you to strengthen your grip. And if you lift them straight out, there's no issue with them. You go down to 30. See, you just lift up, set them back down. 15. I always thought Gold's Gym was kind of a cheaper brand, but these are really good quality. I mean, you don't want to be dropping them on the floor, but. Um, other than that, I think they're going to hold up really well. Especially if you get them cheap off Craigslist like I did. <clears throat> I didn't expect a whole lot out of them. So in conclusion, I wouldn't buy these dumbbells for the asking retail price they want for them. I think it's $340 or something. I, I just I don't think they're worth that. I actually got these for right around a hundred bucks. I bought these with a hoist bench on Craigslist for a total of 200. So I just kind of figured I paid a hundred for the bench and a hundred for these. Um, for that price, you can't beat them. They're great. I've been using them for over two years and I've had no problems with them. As far as the other adjustable dumbbells, the only other ones I've had experience with are the Iron Master, but they're $550. You know, and they're more like a, a regular professional dumbbell. So, yeah, if you, want to, if you want the really good ones, get the Iron Masters. But for the money, get these used. They're great. So that's going to wrap up the video. I thank you for watching and have a great day.